Welcome back YouTube, this is Two Point Show coming at you here with a quick little video and I just hope you guys enjoy. So anyways, let's get right into it. So first of all, I've realized that the 9 star quest here, I'm getting so much more um, cogwheels, coins, whatever you want to call them, just naturally. And it seems like so many of the things that I'm getting are more than the 6 star. And you know, just to just to clarify, I know that my mouse is not on screen, but just stay with me. So again, orb, two orbs, two scrolls, so on and so forth. 500. These ones are massive. I, I don't even get those on the six star quest. And I have so many of these. And then I still have 100s. And then this whole row, the bottom row, is all 100s. So again, if you guys are looking to maximize your stones... Um, in the Celestial Island. I think this is the way to go. Not only that, I'm getting 8,000, I think 8,400 experience, um, which we'll look at that later. But I just want to run through, hopefully we can get, you know, one of those. Um, and normally I get those by fights, uh, you know, PvP fights. And if that's the case, you know, some sometimes I get other stuff. But Still, that is literally five times the amount. And sure, you know what you're saying is, well, you'll get them, you know, 20 days. Like, you still have 20 days left. And although that's true, I'm still getting so much more than on my junior account for the six stars. Dang it, we were so close. But anyways, I think in the long run, you get so much more out of these. And again, I talked to a few people, and it looks like, you know, six star quests, they're good, they're easy, they're quick. But the rewards, they're not as valuable. They're not as high. We'll come back to that later. Um, but still, okay. 21,000. And you get 8,000 8, of those. That's where I was confused. But still, I have 5 of the 500. That's already over 10,000. And then I have a whole row of 100s. You're looking at probably 1,100. 1, 11,000 upgrade into these. That's crazy. Like, whenever I finish, I will definitely show you. And again, we're halfway done. We're probably going to get more. Also, these are super cool. Dang it, I'm out. Um, I've been doing those just one a day. And, you know, I mean, I'm out of stones. And I would definitely recommend it to anyone free to play or not. You know, like, I'm doing 2,000, maybe more, summons. And, um, you know, that means... I'm going to need all the bag space I can. And another way, another thing that I have noticed that some people don't do is I smash the boss like this. And again, you might be wondering why. But again, orange artifact shards. Yes, we got two right there. Again, those are super valuable and you can get them super easy. They're great food if, you know, they're trash. And if not, then they're actually pretty, pretty good. And early game, you know, you want as many as you can. I'll smash this one like normal, but outside of that, that's that. What do you guys think? Um, are you sticking to the 6 star, or are you kind of going to the, the 9 star? And are you investing in, where are they? These, the extra bag slots. I am very curious to know. Your choices, are you, you know, going for monster materials, or what? I can't wait to hear it down below. Personally, I think I'm going to do 9-star quests more often, unless if I need something specific. But again, still, I did 10, and those 5 slots are just so expensive. But anyways, that is that. I can't wait to hear what you guys think. Um, which way are you guys leaning? Anyways, this is Two Point Show. I hope you guys, you know, can get a little bit more knowledge on C Celestial Island. We're still learning, but that's that. Again, I mean, I'm getting 21,000 XP. That's going to be a few levels. Anyways, guys, that is that. Hope you guys enjoy. And again, let me know what you guys are doing down below. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.